Hey guys, Retro Badger here. Hope you're all well. Today we're going to take a look at the USS Sentinel. Now this ship may look slightly familiar to a lot of you. It's clearly heavily based on the Intrepid class prototype. As we know, there were quite a few prototypes for the USS Voyager. There are some key differences with this one, particularly the saucer section, it's actually wider and not as pointier. If anything though, it looks more refined. I particularly like the deflector, I prefer it to Voyagers, I just think it looks better. This ship is armed with photon torpedoes, quantum torpedoes and pulse phasers. I thought a good first test would be to put it up against the USS Voyager, but only using phasers and photon torpedoes. That way, it should make it fairer for Voyager, and then I'm going to try going against the RBG Intrepid class with quantum torpedoes. Okay, so I'm only going to use photons to make it fair. Okay, that's some interesting photons. Definitely different to Voyagers. They're a bit slower as well. That could be a problem. Though we have scored some hull damage, that's good. House of shields. Right, okay, so I am having some issues with torpedo accuracy here. And interestingly, this ship doesn't have a forward phaser array, it's only on the sides. It does come equipped with pulse phasers though, but I'm not going to use those as I think it's a bit unfair to Voyager. And I want to try and balance this as much as possible. Could the prototype have been better? Come on. Okay, that did some damage, that's good. Okay, our phases are drilling through. Gotta be careful not to ram them here. Well, so far, I don't think there's much in this, to be honest. Which I suppose is correct. I've almost got the shield generator, then I can just go for the warp core. Ooh, gosh, that was close. That was way too close. We've lost one of our torpedo launchers. Come on. Uh, okay, am I the only one who saw that? The shield generator was about to go offline and then it repaired itself miraculously. What's going on there? Hmm. Are they using hollow projected ships again by any chance? That's crazy. I've never seen that happen before. That's bizarre. Oh, yep. Well, some of them hit. For some reason, that shield generator seems indestructible. Oh no! We just repaired the front forward torpedo launchers, and then they went offline as soon as I pressed fire. Okay, that's good. Sir, another ship is on a collision course with us. I'm detecting energy Oh no! Oh no! 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 Oh come on! Oh, there we go. Ooh, this is gonna be bad. Oh crap! I think we need to bring in a coffee ban for Janeway. That was ridiculous. Okay, so I can use the full weapons now. Pulse fa oh gosh! Of course, they start with quantums, don't they? Loading quantum torpedo, sir. Yeah, we got pulse phasers, as you just saw. Ooh, no damage to their shields. Right, I need to keep my distance here until we can get quantums. Ah, there we go. Let's hope these are a bit more accurate. That just made her angry. Oh, we hit! Okay, so they are quite accurate, these. We've 
got a target lock. They are quite far out though, aren't they? Can they just outmaneuver those? Oh, they got lucky. Oh, they were nowhere near. <laughs> oh, well played, Janeway. Well played. Or should I say Admiral Ross, actually? He also had an intrepid class, didn't he? Oh, we've lost that aft shield. Oh, I fell for that, didn't I? This is the problem with having torpedo launchers at the front and the back. Tractor beam has been disabled, Captain. Sure has. Ooh. Ooh. Ugh. Well, technically two losses there, but what do you guys think of the design? Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Bye for now.